about a little Italian lesson for you this morning? Catara loosely translates to cat lady in Italian, but it's also the name of one of the newest restaurants in Uptown. So it's not a cat cafe, but you'll see nods to cats pretty much all over, including on their cocktail menu. A calico or angora, anyone? But of course, it's all about the food, and with Italian, that means we're talking pizza. Hey, Chef Thomas. Hi, how are you? Oh, fantastic. We're going to make some pizza. Yeah. Got the pizza oven all fired up, ready to go? We do. Nice and hot, ready to roll. I'm ready. Let's make some. Okay. So what we're doing here is one of you get some of the air bubbles out from the fermenting. Okay. Breakfast of champions. Look at that. All the prosciutto, we got the egg yolk in there. Woo! <laughs> gonna make a mess, gonna make a mess. Now it's my turn. I'm making carbonara. Car Wait, that's pasta, but we're making a carbonara pizza. We're making some of pizza. And four. Nice little like a little. Aha! Uh -huh. nice. Thank you very much. Look at my pizza. Nice. This is gonna be even messier. Look at that egg yolk. Wow. Oh my god. This is incredible. Here's a napkin just in case. <laughs> he knows me so well. Gave me a napkin. Woo! <laughs> After all that hard work, the pizzas have been made, and as the Italians say, mangiamo. <laughs> you ate a lot of pizza in that piece. <laughs> I sure did. It was a really good day for me. Also, I, it is hard to eat on camera. I just, I'm so sorry. I'm a messy eater in general. Everyone who knows, I carry a Tide to Go pen with me everywhere I go. See? So I'm just so sorry. I don't know how the messiest eater got a food segment. Well, um, that is hard to eat, like not yes. messy. I mean, there's just things already yeah. falling off. Yeah. So, so what's the deal with the cats? Is this guy like a cat lover? Or is he... <laughs> you know, it, it's just kind of a fun little play that they had. They knew they wanted this attack. Italian theme. Um, they loved Katara and that it was it means cat lady. And so they just kind of leaned into it. And I think it's really funny. The decorations, I mean, all around, you can just see like little nods to cats everywhere. Oh, it looks so good. The pizza's amazing. I love like, so I actually, I studied abroad in Italy. So that Italian pizza, that style mm -hmm. is one of my favorites that they have. And so it's pretty true to how they make it there. Yeah. And the oven, I mean, you know, you put it in that oven and oh my goodness, it does <laughs> wonderful things. Did you see my skills with the, I don't know what it's called, but that big, the big spatula thing? Oh, the big spatula <laughs> thing. That's what it's called. <laughs> the big spatula thing. Throw like it in that. there, turn it around. Oh, my skill. <laughs> Maybe I should learn what that. it's called before I brag about my skill. <laughs> it looks right. good. So what's coming up next yeah. in the best job in television? Yeah, it's pretty good. Uh, Lost City is, I'm, it's a coffee shop and they mm. do food oh. in town and they've got ties to refugee communities here oh, in nice. Denver so um, they bring in a lot of recipes and uh, you know just different ingredients that you might not see everywhere else and then mm. a lot of that goes back to refugee communities. So, I love that. Yeah I'm really excited so I'm going to be heading there um, right after the show. It's right. a lot of fun. Where Sounds are you good. getting ideas from because some of these places <laughs> I've, I've never heard of and they're so great. You know I mean the, from all over you know kind of talking to people if you have a great place a great restaurant with a great story behind it I would love to hear yes. about it so just shoot me an email Kylie.first.90s.com. So all right sounds good we'll see you uh, next time okay <laughs>